my darling dollies and welcome to my playthrough of The Walking Dead Season 2. I've been super excited for this. I really enjoyed the first game. It was actually my favourite game to the point where I watched Cry Aotic play it. I watched Cinnamon Toast Ken play it. I pretty much did a few playthroughs that I watched on, on YouTube as well as playing the game myself. It was a... Uh, a heartbreaking and tragic story and I didn't sadly get to record it so uh, obviously anyone with a heart did anything for Clem including chopping off her arm I raised my hand to that I did I took it off I uh, saved Ben I killed Dark and broke my heart and stuff like that so yeah that's a little bit about what I did with that one um, I did hear that the choices you made in the other game and the choices you make in 400 days plays it it does play a role in this one maybe not much but it does so i'm also looking forward to how that plays out um when i played the 400 days i managed to get everybody but vince to come with me i think he's personally impossible but I'm going to go ahead and jump in now. My recording program is being a douche and it won't let me put it in the other window so I can't see how long I'm recording for but I have set an alarm for half an hour otherwise I tend to get a little bit lengthy with my videos if anyone's noticed that yet. Oops. Okay, let's start. Oh. Yeah. Hello. So apparently my game, oh well, my recording program done fucked up and I've played through about 20 minutes of the game to realise that I done fucked up. I've had to try and do it in a different way to get it to work, but yeah, here we go. You've been all by yourself through this. I know who you are, and I know you are a killer. Prick. Not how the world works now. I hope you know what you're doing with her. I got it! Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. It means it must be where my mom and dad are. Valentina, I think it'd be safer for you to stay here with Owen. Clementine! Clementine! My well, tibia arm is way strong. I don't know why I just said that. I'm such a dog. <laughs> it's because I can't handle the feels. I get all emotional when it comes to Leo Clam. Because. 
Come on, Krista. What's wrong with Omid? We're not calling our baby Omid. One of you is enough. Clementine, a little help here? Omid the second. No. Omid Jr. Omid is a good name. I like it. Thank you, Clementine. You always agree with him. Because <laughs> I'm always right. You're not taking this seriously. I take everything seriously. Especially the Lomit's future. Keep talking, or you'll be sleeping in the ring tonight. Remember that time in Barstow? Vegas weekend? Meow. Why don't you uh, uh, get cleaned up in the girls' room, Clem? I hope the sink works in there. I wouldn't count on it. Just be careful and make sure to keep track of your things. We'll be right next door. Okay. Indeed, baby girl. What's that? It's just a bunny rabbit. Yay for empty bathrooms. Guess it's safe to get cleaned up. Please have water. Let's get you cleaned up, my baby girl. I'm rather attached to Clem. I think most people are who've played this game or watched it. Nice hanky she got there. Beautiful, baby. Yes, better. Oh, shit. Swear? I really want to grab my stuff, but it won't let me. But that figures, doesn't it? Baby, quietly. <laughs> I see you. Get out of there. You're not fooling me. Who are you? None of your business. Are you gonna hurt me? Only if you're stupid. Get out here. anything on you? Come on, let's see. I ain't gonna ask again. No, that's all I have. That's it? How'd you make it this long? Great difficulty. I'm serious. What else you got? That's it. Don't lie to me. I'll pop. Give me what you got. I'm not screwing around. Come on. 
I don't have anything. Give me that hat. No. Uh-uh. Not a chance. Where did you get it? I asked you a question. My dad gave it to me. Just give it to me. No. How fucking no. Junk, junk, junk. Look at all this junk. Shit, shit, and more shit. Why you ain't got nothing good? Not like the last people I got. Oh, it's gonna get you. Oh, it's gonna get you. You're just a little fish. You gonna cry, little fish? This your daddy? What a bozo. Oh, shit. I've already watched this, but it still cuts me up seeing it. This is one fucking way to start the game, that's for sure. Right, fucker, if you ask me. Of course, our baby girl didn't get it easy. Because that would be too nice, right? Telltale games, yeah? a fire so you can cook and stay warm it's something you have to be able to do clementine otherwise christy you have gotten harsh with your loss though i think i can understand as there is clearly no baby Omid said <coughs> i know what Omid said You think this is bad? Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me <coughs> about cold. If we make it. We still have a couple hard months ahead of us. This rain will turn to snow. <coughs> then snow. It won't be easy. Can we make it that far? Maybe. I don't know. We just need to keep moving north. We sure as hell can't stay here. Wellington. We'll try the best we can. I'm gonna go look for more wood. You just keep the fire lit.
So sweet and innocent you once were, baby girl. Oh, I don't even know. This is harsh. I like how she has a butterfly light on because, you know, why the fuck not? She's still sort of innocent, eh? Not burning a foot early. Broke my heart when Lee died. I had hope of him being saved, but I don't think I'm going to be that lucky. Almost a year and a half later, and they haven't found him. I'm pretty sure he's gone. Oh, I didn't have Clem shoot him in the face for that reason, obviously. Where's the rest of your crew? I, I'm by myself. Bullshit. He's lying. Cut the shit, lady. It's it's just me. What the Krista, fuck? Run! Hey. Oh, Go, Clem, go. Get the fuck over here. Now! We can do this, girly. Come out here, girl. I'm not fucking around. Shit! Get the fuck over here! God damn it! I am not kidding you. Bite him, bite him, bite him, bite him, bite him, bite him. Yeah. Not a girl. Kick the shit into him, Pam. I like cattails, cattails are cute. But, like, 
to look at way and not to have in my space. <laughs> no one be sending me cattails. Creepies. Poor baby. She learned nothing when Lee, with Lee. Let's just yell and get all the walkers up in our space. <laughs> because that's the clever thing to do. And them jeans, baby girl, them jeans. They look good on you. It's nice to see you're out of a dress, to be honest. I mean, I'm all for cuteness, but... Yeah. At least she's clean now and like all of her clothes are too because she just had a really big bath in the river and her hair probably doesn't smell so bad and the blood's probably a little bit washed out of her heart not a lot but a little bit Okay, well, this is as good a place as I need to stop it. Thank you for sticking with me to watch this episode of The Walking Dead, and I'll see you next time, my dollies.